Andrew. Hi, Andrew. Hey, Ed. Hey, Ed. How are you guys doing today? We're great. Thanks. Fantastic. Hey, Ed, just, I, I'm so happy that I could call through and say thanks for the three years. You're an amazing uh, producer, your jokes, uh, your insights, fantastic. So I wanted to uh, give you a, my favorite Rush story and how they impacted one of my favorite people in the entire world. In 1960, my friend Alvin Law's mom took a drug called thalidomide, to help her with her morning sickness. The Lidomide, thankfully, was never approved in America, but was approved in Canada for about five years. You may recall that this drug, unfortunately, caused deformities, and my friend Alvin was born without arms in 1960. In 1980, he became a motivational speaker comedian, spoke at my high school when I was 17, and we became friends, and I myself became a motivational speaker and leadership trainer. Five, six years ago, he was speaking on a conference with me, and I was filming him. And you can find this on YouTube when you type in Alvin Law, A-L-V-I-N, Law, L-A-W, Drummond. Alvin Law Drummond. As he's introducing his piece about drumming, because he's going to surprise the kids, but because he can play a full drum kit with his feet, he says the following. My life changed when I discovered 2112 by Rush and a drummer named Neil Peart. And if I ever got the opportunity to meet Neil Peart, he said, I would tell him, thanks for saving my life. And when you're an awkward 16-year-old kid in 1976, whose first name is Elvin, and you have no arms, wow. and you're living in rural Saskatchewan, Canada, life can be tough at times. And when I discovered 2112, I discovered that I wanted to be like Neil. And I practiced 18, 20, 22 hours a week to be like Neil. And as he's doing it, you start hearing him get better and better at the drums. People don't know that he plays the drums just until he gets into it. And so that video got through to Rush. And about a year later, they were playing in Calgary. He got, uh, not quite front row, but very close tickets. He got to meet, of course, Debbie and Alex. But didn't get to meet Neil, but when he met Getty and Alex, they said, Neil appreciated your story and handed him signed drumsticks that he still treasures to this day. And so I know that uh, we all miss Neil. And I just wanted you to know that very touching, amazing story about a friend of mine who does everything with his feet, drives, plays piano, even the license plate on his uh, vehicle says toes i mean he's just a hilarious wonderful guy watch his videos on youtube one more time elvin law and you go elvin law drum and you'll see it and uh, he's also rather famous because in the uk they had an amazing video for the paralympics in 2016 called we're the superhumans we're the superhumans and for the paralympic video all the musicians had different uh, uh, physical challenges. And the opening drum roll of this very famous commercial is my buddy Alvin doing a full drum roll with his feet on a full kit. And if you go wow. to uh, YouTube that, you'll see it's, it's amazing. So to you, Ed Robinson, thanks for all you've done for three years. And to you, Ed, hey, the high, throughout this pandemic, you've been keeping us going, man. I remember when you were recording all your stuff in April, man, we really appreciated all you've done for us during these challenging times. To both of you guys, Andrew. thank you. Well, wow, amazing call. What a way to start off the calls. Thank you so much, Andrew. Best to your friend, Elvin. We'll you look bet. him up online. An, an amazing story. Thank you for listening and for your kind words. Uh, incredible. He plays drums with, he has no arms and he plays drums with his feet completely. That is uh, amazing. Elvin Law. We'll have to look him up. Andrew, thank you so much for that. Appreciate it very much. Have a great weekend. Here's Patrick from Ohio. Hi,